Hi. Talking about LED controllers and why I'm using them at the moment. I'm using this particular LED control. The basic circuit board is just well, no bigger than my pinky. And this is the battery source, positive and negative, even though the negative is white. And this will be connected to some sort of LED I've been trying. All sorts, all, all sorts of LED uh, lights, including some theory lights that I've got hold on precariously on my drone. And instructions are fairly easy, you can see that. Um, positive and negative to connect to the battery, and positive to the negative for the um, LED. And there's two versions, the 12 volt version, which this is, uh, it's a bit too high for the voltage for, for what I need. And there's a 5 volt version, which I've already tested with a 9 volt battery, and that seems to work. But, uh, in, in this case, I'm using like 12 volts here. And testing how high this 5 volt LED controller can go. So I'm using this uh, 12 volt battery over the LED controller, and it's all connected to these lights. Uh, this isn't the final result, I'm, I'm just check, checking this out. But what I'm doing is basically connecting it up so can control it with a remote controller. Uh, there's an off on switch, uh, full brightness, uh, half brightness, quarter brightness, uh, brightness increment and, and decrease. Uh, mode select, which is basically flashing different um, light and speeds. So if I just press the button, it's using a particular mode at the moment. So I can change the mode. Yes. Pulsating. Uh, that one seems like a slower pulsating. Basically it's it's different flashes. Okay, you can speed it up. Slow it down, which is quite funny. Um, there's the uh, core brightness, half full brightness. You can see a slight difference. And then there's the increments, which is what you expect from the increment in the brightness. This is fully on and fully off. Uh, switching it off again. Anyway, this is just a suggestion if you're using these types of um, LED controllers, they can be quite fun. Um, I would tidy up this wiring actually, use some different kind of LEDs, but basically, it's just the battery. The actual um, controller and the light bulbs. Uh, this is supplying something like 2.5 volts to, to the LED bulbs, so it's not a lot of power, but it's still fun nevertheless. And if you sort this out, you should. Get some decent glowy lights for your drone. I'll see you next week.